So separation, this is before the CIA and after the condenser. So like at the condenser, she thinks she's lost Aiden. So what, what's this about separation? Ready? Oh. Yeah. Back in the lab. Cole? Okay, I'm recording. Now concentrate, Jody. Tell me if you feel anything in particular about any of these objects. Okay. Well, I don't know. That's a coin. That's a box, actually. Sorry. Oh. Can you see anything, Ida? Uh, I, I probably can. If you give me a moment. Thank you, Dad. It's so pretty. Well, that's... That's his daughter. But, uh, I don't know who his daughter is, but that's his daughter's box of stuff. Jody. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Did you see something? Yeah. Speak. I saw a little girl. It was her music box. Oh, I see. So your daughter is, I would assume, dead, and you're now attaching onto Jody as a result. Yeah. Nathan? Okay, I'll tell him. Nathan, someone named Ryan Clayton is here to see you. He says you know what it's about. Uh, okay. Was that guy Ryan from the CIA? Yes. Uh, I'll be back in a moment. I'm not sure it might have been. Shit, it is. Look, there he is. It might be. Let's take yeah, let's take that off. We've had enough of the crown. Uh stand up. I like her outfits. They're very nice. Um, let's go and say hello to Cole. Nathan. Hasn't Nathan been I don't know, just like acting kinda strange lately? He's trying to raise money for the lab at the moment. Maybe he's worried about it. You know how he is. Maybe. Uh, I, uh, homework? I hope we don't finish too late. I have tons of homework to do. You know, Nathan's always complaining when I get bad grades, but he's always keeping me here when I should be studying. <laughs> That's a discussion you'll have to have with him, Princess. Thank you, Cole. Uh, hungry. I'm so hungry. When do we get a break? Yeah, I'm hungry too. We need to get Nathan out of here for once. Somewhere fancy. I'm sick of cafeteria food. What do you order in? Some nice Chinese or something. Uh, long? Do you think he'll be long? Relax, princess. He'll be back in a minute. Okay, and then the last one on the list is visitor. Do you know this guy who's come to see Nathan? No idea. You're so helpful, dude. Thanks. Thanks for that. Really helpful. Um, okay, well... Oh, you know what we can do? There we go! Whoop! Where am I going? I'm going out here. Hello. Listen. What are you up to? I never get around to telling her I need more time. Uh-oh. No. Professor Dawkins, she needs to come with me today. I... I have my orders. Christ, she's only a child. My assistant and I are the only family she's got. She doesn't have any idea what's out there. This is not going to go down well with Aiden. Look, Dawkins, I see your side of it. All right, I do. But orders are orders, right? You going to bring her to me or do I have to go and get her? This is not going to go down well. Really not going to go down well. Shit, okay. Jody, could you come here, please? Guess what? The CIA want you, and we're going today, and yeah, this this might not be good at all. What's what's going on, Nathan? You you look upset. Jody, this is Ryan Clayton from the CIA. The agents. 
The agency wants you to join their military school program at Camp Perry. Yep, that's what's happening. They're shipping you off. Ryan's going to take care of you from now on. You have to go with them, Jody. Today. Uh, what about the experiments? What about the experiments? I thought we were working together. I'm sorry, Jody. It's out of my hands. Beg. I'm begging you, Nathan. Please don't let them take me away. Hey, Jody, I know. It's difficult, but you need to understand this is a great opportunity for you. You say that, but they're gonna, like, be a bitch about it. You know what's best, and I'm, I'm just supposed to shut up and obey orders? Jesus, listen up, Miss Holmes. I don't give a shit about your pathetic adolescent powder. Whoa! Right? You can rant and rave all you want, but just shut your mouth and do as you're told. Wow. You know what, dude? Fuck you. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> That's it. Let's go. Come here. Oh, no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Jody. You've just caused big shit. Jody, stop immediately, immediately. The music did have a spaz there, because it was loading something. Do this for me. Oh. I'll go get my things. <laughs> Only the essentials. Well, fuck off. We've got everything you need at camp. Bullshit I have. I haven't got a cuddly toy. That's coming with me. <laughs> oh my god, there's a bag there. Someone's fucking put a bag there for me to pack. But damn. <laughs> Right, what do we need? Let's go round. Oh god, this is sad. I want my I want this. Yes, I have the bunny. Put the bunny in. Put the bunny in the bag. Bunny in the bag. He's not going in the wardrobe. He's coming with us. I know, I know. I'm pretty pissed off as well. What's this? Can we sit down? Oh we can. Okay, get up. That's not... I thought you were going to do something else, but no. Uh, put the bunny in the bag. Put the bunny in the bag. Um, do we need any of these clothes? Okay, yes, apparently we do. I'm not quite sure what we just took, but... Sure, I want that. I want that photo. We are putting that in the bag. We're putting everything that's sentimental in the bag. What's in here? Oh, Christ. Uh, yeah, we're going to need some toiletries. Um, what about anything in here? Anything in here? Anything in here? No, okay, that's that's everything. I noticed there were some photos of her and her fake mum uh, on the mirror she hasn't taken. So, oh dear. Oh, oh, there's a photo. Let's put it in the bag. Sod it. I'll humour you and put it in the bag. You may need it later on in your life. Uh, God, what else? I can't see anything else. There's a book there. No, I think that might be everything. Ah, hello. Put it in the bag, sure. Of, picture of me and uh, me and my little friend. I think that's probably it. I think we're good to go. There we go. All done. Bye, room. Maybe see you later. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll be great. Don't 
Don't. I'm going to cry, Cole. Don't. Damn. I'm going to miss the hell out of you, princess. I said don't, but fine. The tears are back. Ooh. I'll come and see you as soon as I can. Bullshit you will. I bet you never come. I'll never let you down. You know that, don't you? Then why is she homeless and running from the police and stuff? I'll always be there for you. What the hell happens? Time to go. Oh. Bye, guys. The dinner. Oh, so this is after the embassy. But before... Oh, shit. So something happens between the embassy and, and Hunted. Maybe it's the dinner. There's a massive gap still as well between the prologue and Navajo. Oh. Right. Hello. Yeah? Jody. Hey, it's, it's Ryan. Ryan? I was just wondering if you got my email. What, what, wait, what, what email? The one I sent three days ago. You haven't checked your email, have you? You know, I've... <laughs> I've actually been having problems with my computer. What what was the email about? Dinner, tonight, fancy restaurant. Oh. <laughs> anyway, it, it's too late now, so maybe another time? Shit. Maybe. Um, shit, I'm so sorry. I... You, no, why, why don't you just come over here for dinner? <laughs> dinner? Okay. I mean, you wanted to see my apartment anyway, so... Uh, sure, but I... How about around eight? Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring a kick-ass bottle of wine. See you later. If she's going on a date, isn't, like... Not that Aiden's got, like, any sort of feelings for her, but isn't that a bit weird? Isn't it like a third wheel? Yeah, you got to tidy up the house, like, fucking quick and all that. <laughs> now I get why you blast him on oh. the computer. Oh! You didn't want me to see Ryan. Oh shit, Aiden. It's not your call, Aiden. I can do what I want. Oh dear. Naughty, naughty. Fuck this. Fuck this! We're not gonna start this again. I'm not yours, Aiden. I can have a relationship with whoever I want. This is my life. Oh, do you fucking hear me? This is my life. Oh dear. I happen to think Ryan is great. He's charming, he's intelligent, he's funny. And I think I'm falling for him. Oh shit, don't do this. Okay. Okay. It's seven o'clock. You've got an hour. I have an hour to make dinner, tidy up, and make myself look. Why are you making dinner? Like, he should have just, you should have told him to, like, bring some Chinese over. Look at this fucking place. What have you done? Yeah, that's not the best way to start tidying. Um, good. Okay. The trash can in the kitchen. Yep, I can see it. I have eyes. I don't think that's supposed to go in there. Oh, there's a cookbook. That might be helpful. Oh, shit, hello. What's this? What is that? Oh, is that wine? Uh, no, let's put that down. I don't think we'll have any more. I don't know what it is. It's obviously some kind of alcohol. Uh, cookbook, cookbook, cookbook. Come on. I gotta find something I can make in one hour with what's ever left in the fridge. Well, I should point out that you've actually got less than an hour because you've got to make yourself look good as well. Asian beef. Uh, I mean, that looks good. It's not too complicated. 
curried chicken with oven-baked vegetables. It'll take some time in the oven, but it seems doable. I'd probably go with a chicken- uh, oh. Pizza delivery. Uh. I mean, it's not exactly gourmet, but it, it, no preparation, no mess. I'd I mean, probably go with the pizza, actually. It could be an option. Uh, but I think he'll probably like a nice chicken curry. Yeah, chicken curry? With a little down-home flavour? I mean, he's gonna love that. And as long as I don't fuck it up. Well, exactly. Uh, now I should point out that if you're cooking in the oven, you should be fine, because, um, whilst it's cooking in the oven, you can go and- oh, shit, hello. Oh, God! Oh, shit, have we got everything? I think we might have. Okay, I think we should be alright. God, I hope you don't want to cut me to cut things. Oh, ah! What are you doing? Don't be a dick. Thank you. Thanks, Aiden. I'm not sure if that was a peace offering or a threatening thing. But, you know, whatever. Yeah, so chicken curry, you make it, you leave it in the oven, and whilst it's in the oven, you can go and do your shit and get ready. Look nice. Oh. Now, if only you could teach Aiden how to, uh, <laughs> how to chop vegetables, and he wouldn't have to worry about crying. Good. You shouldn't have raw meat on the same plate as vegetables, but that's fine if that's how you want to roll. That's your health and safety problem, I guess. So far, so good. That knife is worrying me. Can we, like, put it away? Take an oven dish. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is literally like... Eh, that's a pressure cooker. You could have used that. Actually, no, you can't use that. It's a bit too late in the day. Now you could have asked Aiden, but you know, sure, we'll do it this way. Ah, that's what you were going for. I was going to say, why are you go for a walk? You can't put that in the oven. You melt the handle on the plastic. Right. Oh shit! Turn. God, this is like cooking sim, except except slightly out of control. Jeez, I gotta hurry, or we'll have nothing to eat. Shit. This is so not how you do this. Like, by the way, guys, this is not how you make a chicken curry. You don't just scrape it all into a casserole pan with no sauce. Some convenient herbs that just happen to be on the side. That has suddenly transformed. There was no sauce. That's what I, like, that's magic, that is. I think that's probably enough. Oh shit, I've just realised I'm supposed to put it back. That was gin... okay. Uh, put a little bit of pepper in. Oh god, I've... Oh shit, no, 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 I wanted pepper, come on. I have two, three, and then that's enough. Oh god, I put a lot of curry powder in that. I need to put some ginger in. Ginger? It's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. No, that's not what it's for. It's, I mean, it's not in the recipe, but... Uh, in that case, we're going to put it well, back if it's not in the that. recipe. I'm pretty sure you do put ginger in curry, but maybe that's because I cook predominantly Thai curry. So maybe I'm wrong a little bit. Put uh, one more salt in, because curries tend to need a little bit of salt. There we go. This is going to taste disgusting, isn't it? He's going to be like, you've made some sort of monstrosity. Uh, and we'll stop. And then we'll put it in the oven. Well, and hopefully... Into the oven we go. You didn't preheat the oven either, so this is probably not going to cook in time. Uh, yep, turn the knob. Well done. Right. Oh, fuck! I'm only in my pants. Crap. Hello. Crap, he's early. I'm coming. Oh, shit. It's all this shit on the floor. Oh, my God, we've not picked anything up. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm panicking. Where's the bloody door? Where is the front door? Uh, oh shit, there it is. There it is. <laughs> I was having a panic. Don't answer in your pants. Oh. What? Is this Aiden playing with us? Oh, it is. Oh, Aiden. Oh, good one, Aiden. Okay, you got me. Now, open the door. Shit. Aiden! Aiden, come on, open up! This is a bit lame, Aiden. You are being a bit of a dick here. Oh. Oh, I fucked that up. Jesus. Uh, I can't... I don't have all those hands. I'm the one who makes decisions around here, Aiden. Oh, you wanna play games? I can play too. Don't, don't have... This is not the time. This is not the time to, like, try and control Aiden. Just... He wants to be a big baby, that's fine. You know, you're wasting your time, Aiden. You're not going to stop me from seeing Ryan. Can we... Oh, for the love of God. This is what, like, paranormal activity had to deal with. Now, just don't be a... I understand why I was quite annoyed, actually. Like, I'd be quite annoyed. Um, but... Still. Oh, shit, the bedroom's a mess. He shouldn't be going in here. So it's okay. Dirty clothes in the basket in the bathroom. In the basket in the bathroom? Must be this basket in the bathroom. All right, there. Oh, yes, right. Not having a bath, it's too too late for a bath, but we are gonna freshen up our face. Oh, okay, that was not what I wanted to do. Oh, that's that's all we can do in, in the bathroom. Oh, and um, look out the window. I'm not sure why you're looking. You're quite high up. You're not going to actually see anything. Unless... I, I don't even know. I don't, what are we doing in here? Surely you want to brush your teeth. Come on. In, in the... In the... In the... In the... In the thing. No. Nothing in here. Okay. Out we go. Now. We need to find some clothes. Oh shit. Hello. Ah. Shower. I'd shut the blinds, but okay, apparently that's not something we do in this house. Or, you know, shut the thing. That's enough of that, we've had a shower. Find the towel. There we go. You don't need him, you have me. Did you see that? I don't know if we're going to actually see that or whether it will be gone. By the time we uh, finish drying ourselves. That's impressive how you dried your hair with it tied up. Yeah, didn't see that. That's a bit fucking creepy, isn't it? Oh no, it's still there. But this is, I can understand why like you could sort of take Aiden as being like a little bit evil or, or not. Like he could just be a jealous little sausage of someone stealing his time. Christ, Aiden. Look, you just don't get it. Oh my god. Don't piss him off, please. <sighs> please don't piss him off. I'm scared. If you piss him off, we're going to have all kinds of shizzle. What should I wear? Uh, I would go with cool. I'm not, I'm not dressing up as sexy or elegant because that's ridiculous. Oh, hey, Ryan. Yeah, whatever. I just, like, threw these old things on, because... Yeah, I'm cool. I'm cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna be me. I mean, there's no point in me throwing myself at the guy. Well, exactly, because Aiden will probably just, like, kill him. That's nice. Oh, dear. You might as well just give up, Aiden. Okay? This date is going on. 
Period. Oh, Christ. This is not going to end well. This is not going to end well at all. Come on, Aiden, don't be a pain in the ass. Aiden... God, I, I kind of understand where he's coming from. So, totally. Because, like, I'd be pretty pissed off if I had to share my life with some person. I didn't have a choice, but... Yeah, I, oh God, I don't know what to do, really. Don't just shove it under there. You've got drawers, woman. It's probably the least tidy I've ever seen. Um, there was also something else I could do here, but I don't know where it's gone, so I'll leave it. Um, that's a game or a book. Yeah, pick them up and put them... Books. Oh. Okay, on the bookshelf. Where's the bookshelf? The bookshelf is somewhere... So, so, ah, the bookshelf. Christ. Is this the bookshelf? I don't know. It's all these fancy modern ones. There we go. Okay, great. Now, I am gonna... What's, 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 what's here? What's here? No? Okay. Let's go check on the curry. That sounds promising. Can we check on it? No. I could pick something up, though. So... What, what was it? Ah! Ah! Is it the drink again? Yes, it is. No, put that down. We're not having any more. Good lord. Don't want to turn up completely trash, do you? What will he think? You just turn up complete. If you're just like sozzled out of your mind, he's gonna absolutely love that. Oh yeah, do the dishes. Hayden's not gonna throw them over the floor or anything. Hmm. We go. Dishes are done. Hooray! We check. I want to check this. I want to check what it's looking like, but we can't. What's the time? Oh god, we've got loads of time. Is there anything to tidy in here or faff with in here? No, apparently not. Oh, hello. Have a little snooze. Chill out, Jody. Okay, just calm down. There's no need to panic. You're gonna be great. Maybe. Maybe not. Shit, what if Aiden's fiddled with the alarm? With the time? No, it's it is half it's half seven. Okay. Um Oh shit, gotta pick this stuff up. Or maybe we don't, okay. God. But I'm not I'm not used to doing this. I don't do preparing for dates. It's not a thing. I probably I'd probably go with the choice that I made, like just wear stuff I normally wear. Not I maybe a little bit fancier than normal, but I wouldn't go all out because good grief. Oh shit, he's here! He's early. God, that's good timing. I love that the message in the bathroom is still on the bloody thing. I mean, we'll have to deal with that, I'm sure, at some point. That'll be awkward. Hello! No, he's he's definitely here. You've tidied the room. They're not going to be there when you get back. He's going to have thrown them across the floor. I didn't behave yourself. This is important to me, and I'm counting on you. Good luck with that. Thank <laughs> you.